probably more concerned about saying something, the wrong type of word, and then being on TV more than the coaches hearing us on the other side. But, I mean, it's awkward to be play football in a silent place. I mean, we don't even do that at practice. We have music playing at practice, you know, people going. So to go in there, it was, you know, I wanted to use the noise, but we don't know exactly the rules on that yet. So I, I don't want to experiment with that until we know. So we experimented with the silent practice, and that might be how the games are. So um, we got that experience down, and it's, it is what it is. I don't think there's – a big advantage or disadvantage to it. Everyone's in the same boat with that. It's just guys getting used to it. And it's, I mean, it's, I don't, since even small in high school, when you don't have many people in the stands, there's still noise. So um, we'll see how that goes. Kyle, you seemed a little frustrated with the offense at certain times. Did you, was there anything specific or was it just like the energy or just the focus? What was? Probably just able to see me better, I guess. I'm really never a practice. I'm not frustrated out there. It's probably the same way I look in games most of the time, too. Um, I, the way I focus is kind of get irritated at everything. But um, and I'm mad when every play doesn't work. And then when you're also um, counting on the defense to do the same thing, too, and the special teams, it, it usually doesn't put me in that great of a situation. I'm, I'm upset one way or the other at everything. So, um I think guys get used to that out there. I think people used to take it a little more like what's wrong with coach, but I think now they kind of know how I am. So I want to look into it too much 